happen in an hour for Five News tonight. For now, thanks for watching. Bye bye. Hi there, I'm Sean Welby. Well, the weekend is here and it's looking to be quite unsettled at times. It will be rather humid, particularly towards the southeast, but wet for many and unseasonably windy too as low pressure moves in from the Atlantic. So first thing tomorrow morning, it will be a muggy start for many, perhaps misty and foggy towards the southwest and quite breezy as well along these exposed western coasts. Now, through the course of the day, we will be seeing outbreaks of rain. Uh, they will become more patchy into the afternoon with some drier spells in between and there'll also be some decent spells of sunshine developing into the afternoon uh, anywhere really south of the Midlands further north perhaps a little bit cloudier and some of this rain will be heavier at times now it's the southeast that's going to feel particularly warm and muggy we're looking at highs of 26 or even 27 degrees possible in the greater London area so it's going to be a very warm afternoon on Saturday for most through the evening and overnight more showers are filtered through on this southwesterly wind and Sunday gets off to a rather unsettled start the Pollen Count, sponsored by CheckerTrade.com. CheckerTrade, CheckerTrade.com. Well, if you do suffer with hay fever, you'll have noticed that all week the pollen levels have been high or very high. So the symptoms have been off the scale. Now, tomorrow we have some varying levels. In Northern Ireland, the levels here are very high. The south of England will have high to very high levels. And elsewhere, the levels will be moderate. The Pollen Count, sponsored by CheckerTrade.com. CheckerTrade, CheckerTrade.com.